हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू इंडियन ओरेकल सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ऑन अकाउंट एलियाज इश्यू एंड रिसिप्ट इन इन्वेंट्री ट्रांजेक्शन्स सो बेसिकली वेन एवर यू आर यू वॉन्ट टू इंक्रीज और डिक्रीज द ऑन हैंड क्वान्टिटी फ्रॉम ओरेकल सिस्टम और इन फ्रॉम इन्वेंट्री वी आर यूजिंग दिस ट्रांजेक्शन्स so we can also no, we can normally use that miscellaneous issue and miscellaneous receipt as well but here i am going to discuss on account alias issue as well as on account alias receipts so what if for basically what is the difference between miscellaneous issue and account alias issue so basically while doing miscellaneous issue and receipt you can give an account manually at the time of doing transaction and while uh, in account alias issue and receipt uh, you have defined different source types while doing this transactions from before and whenever you are going to perform this transactions you need to just add the source and you don't need to enter the accounts manually each and every time this is the only difference friends i will show you for example this is the miscellaneous transactions window here i will be having first miscellaneous issue so here if i want to give an so give an any source then it's okay and if i want to give any account here then it's okay otherwise i can keep it blank as well and let me give an item here if i will be giving an item i need to provide a sub inventory and quantity whatever i want to issue from the inventory but here if i see the account field it is not mandatory but while in production many time we are going to record the transaction against any uh, account which will be posted into gl and it will be help it will be helpful our in our month end as well as in reconciliation reports so here i need to enter an account manually but the same thing if i follow sorry guys if i do with the account alias issue see the source type is mandatory because this transaction type will take an account source from uh, prior to performing the transaction so here i will be giving it oracle issue this is what i have defined just now so i will be selecting it and from uh, then i enter the transactions window i just need to enter an item only and if you see here that account field is gray because the system is going to take an account whatever defined be behind this source now you must be wondering that what is the source and from where i can define so if you go into setups same thing will work with oh, receipt transaction as well okay account alias receipts and other receipt transactions and if you go in setup and in account aliases you can define your type here and provide an account here so whatever account you are going to provide here it will take an automatically while performing the transaction and all the transaction will hit against this uh, account sorry mine is this one uh will hit against this account and it will be recorded into system and will post it to gl so this is all about that account alias it looks like complex but it is not actually when you are performing into system it is very easy the concept is also very easy and it is very helpful in our day to day life so done do, do practices keep learning thank you very much i will be coming with another new video for you thank you very much guys subscribe my channel and hit the like button